All right. Cool. Well, welcome, everyone. Thanks for coming. Um, thanks for everyone who worked on the Green Campaign Training School. And uh, we'll give you more detailed shout outs later. But right now, we're a little behind schedule uh, due to some technical difficulties. But uh, thankfully, we have some tech wizards, a lot of tech wizards in the room. So we got through it. Um, yeah, so before we start, just a little bit about uh, what we're attempting to do here today. Uh, so again, my name is Dave Schwab. I'm a co-chair of uh, the Wisconsin Green Party, along with Dotsa Zeps. And um, you know, basically, uh, you know, all of us are here, and we just heard why people are here. Um, and we agree with the vast majority of Americans that our political system is broken, and uh, that we desperately need to do things differently. Um, you know, to avoid economic, social, and ecological crisis. Uh, fortunately, we have the Green Party, which is a growing national and global movement, uh, grassroots movement, for peace, justice, democracy, and ecology. Um, and unlike any other uh, national party in the United States, we don't. the oldest modern democracy in the world, yada, yada, yada. Uh, and yet, uh, you look at the people who are elected, and it's a millionaire's club. It's, it's fast becoming a billionaire's club. Uh, you look at the um, income inequality in, in the United States, and uh, it's, you know, the graph is like a hockey stick, where now the, the wealthiest 1% uh, basically own more than the bottom 90%. And that's globally as well. Uh, we all know the system is unsustainable in every sense of the word. So how does that bring us here today? Well, even though we you know, supposedly live in this great democracy, uh, there's a huge disconnect between regular people and politics in this country. And a big part of it is that the establishment political parties, uh, they are very hierarchical and they play an inside game where basically and train uh, to be lifelong career politicians and everyone else gets the door slammed on them, you know, as we saw pretty graphically in the 2016. We start by uh, empowering regular people to run for office, to be a part of the political process, and uh, you know to learn the basic skills that it takes to run for office, to be part of a campaign, to support someone who you believe in, and um, you know by doing that, to start to break down this uh, broken political system and build a new one that works for all of us. So that, in a nutshell, is why we're here today and why we're putting on the, the Green Campaign Training School. And um, we are live streaming. We're recording this. So uh, in addition to everyone in the room who, you know, as we've already heard, we've got people coming from uh, many different states and, and people making a long haul to get here. But we also hopefully have uh, people watching from around the country. Um, and yeah, so the, the videos that we create today and the materials that we create today, um, you know, we're not going to lock up and give only to our exclusive hand-picked candidates. We're going to uh, crowdsource them and say, we want people to run for office who believe in peace, justice, democracy, and ecology. So um, yeah, and, and just a, a couple notes. So. People probably will have questions during the day. Uh, we want to keep things moving uh, quickly. So if you have a question, please uh, write it down and um, you know, try to get it to one of our uh, Green Party, Wisconsin Green Party people who um, we've already pointed out 
such as Datsa, uh, such as Josh, such as Barb. Um, and we do want to make sure everything is clear. Uh, at the same time, we want to make sure that we are able to get through our agenda for today. And the quicker we get through it, the more time we'll have for questions and answers at the end. Um, does that make sense, everyone? Cool. All right. So, and um, let's see. I'm not seeing Damien right now. Hopefully, I can uh, navigate this machine. Uh, even though I started boycotting Microsoft back when Microsoft was the evil one, uh, now pretty much all tech companies are evil. But it still means that I not the greatest at, uh, at using Windows computers. So if anyone knows what is going on here or knows where Damien went, um, that would be great. What do you go to? There's no, there's no next. There's no next. Let's try escape. Yeah. There we go. All right. All right. Awesome. Cool. So. The first thing we're going to talk about is what we call the campaign keys, which are motivation, participation, and teamwork. All right, so first question is, who is this training for? Um, it's not for politicians, right? They already know this game. be able to invest less than $1,000 personally. Um, probably have been involved in one or more elections previously in some role, uh, supporting a candidate, maybe volunteered. And um, maybe most importantly, the candidate is developing leadership skills by doing, uh, not by commanding others. So we think there's kind of this confusion about the concept of leadership, that people are born leaders, or that you're a leader because you can make other people do what you tell them to do. Uh, whereas we're saying you develop leadership skills by doing things and leading by example. So if you're not the perfect candidate, if you're not uh, you know, what you think of as the ideal candidate from watching the West Wing, that's fine. Um, that's why we're doing this. 